good everybody chris here again chris goes outdoors back in the van we haven't been in the van in quite some time well at least crafting things we haven't been back in the van and i guess we're not technically crafting anything today um i found a piece of trash shelf <laughs> a literal piece of trash that we're going to try to incorporate onto the side of the wall today so we'll probably place it right about here directly on top of the actual wheel well we got some L brackets here we'll use to attach the shelf to the little strip of wood I have behind the wall up here. We'll see. We'll just kind of wing it. We'll see what sticks. All right, so this is the shelf in question and here is the wall. Just fairly tiny uh, little shelf here. So I figure at this height leaves enough space that I can use this as kind of a table for stuff. Got shelves there to store stuff. And then down the bottom, hopefully I'll put a piece of wood down to the ground here, a piece of wood down to the ground here. And uh, I think that that will work for what I want. So then I can still store stuff underneath and it's supported not just by L brackets on the wall there. So I hope that makes sense. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go for it. So let's do it. All right, so if any of you haven't been watching the series, when I did the walls here, there's a uh, one by three or two by three, two by four or something piece of wood that goes along here. It is drilled directly into the metal. So the plan, we'll put this shelf right up here, and then we'll use L brackets to attach it directly to that wood and to the shelf on both sides. So. So, shelf has been marked, I'll break out our L brackets, and I will put an L bracket onto that portion. So we get the mark right there, we'll line the little L bracket up there. Two little marks. So that side is good. Flip it over and do the other. We'll put it up against the wall now. Mark where these holes will have to be drilled on the wall and we'll get that done. So on this side, toward the door here, I'm almost positive that the piece of wood that I have going through here actually ends a little closer back here. So I'm gonna take this one right here, this little L bracket, and just flip it to the inside of the actual shelf here, as opposed to keeping it on the outside. Because I'm pretty sure if I drill it in where it is, I'm not going to hit anything. <laughs> All right, so currently, that is what we get. We got the little L brackets there holding everything in back here. Yeah, so see that piece of wood? That runs the length of the wall there. Those are held in to that piece of wood. And then same thing on that side. So, and it's like surprisingly sturdy pretty happy with how it sits now, but I'm thinking that this will be a good choice just to give it a little more reinforcement. So I have longer ones of these, these are just one by threes, and it's 48 and a half inches from the ground up to the roof here. So my thought is to give it a little more sturdiness over here, I'll cut 48 and a half inches 
let it hit the ground here, go all the way up, and then connect it with another L bracket to the roof. All right, so, so far, this is what we got. I'm going to use a smaller L bracket this time around. I'm going to put it up here and just drill it into the roof, just for a little added stability. Quite honestly, don't think it needs it. We'll do those and then we'll take a look. Also, I'm thinking of putting like a piece of wood, say right here on both of the shelves. That way stuff isn't like moving around at all. Let's uh, get the L brackets screwed in and uh, we'll see what we what we do from there all right so that's what we get you can see right there it's hitting down on the floor and then up here you can see we got the L bracket up to the roof there and then right up there, we got the same thing. It's a little angled because the roof kind of goes down slightly this way. It's kind of hard to hard to see, but should work. Should work for what I need it to anyway. So, and then, like I said, probably cut one more of these. I think I'll screw one of them into the shelf there and then one on the bottom as well. That way, if I have stuff in here, it should, in theory, if it's in like baskets or something, keep it from flying out, so. So that might do it for now. I'm happy with it, it looks nice. It looks nice for me. <laughs> so we'll get some sort of baskets or something. Um, that way I can keep some stuff in here. So yeah, I think that will do it for this video anyway. Um, I do have some curtains I'll be putting up soon, uh, as well as a couple random other things. Um, but we'll see, we'll see when we get around to it. This is the first time I've worked on the van in a while. Uh, in the summertime, it's just so hot, I never feel like coming out here to do anything. Um, and it's like prime hiking season during that. And even now in the fall it is too, but we'll be back. We'll be back up there soon enough. I'm sure the foliage is popping already, so uh, that's it. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching everyone. Take care.